We'll live the life of a hacker, just hot glue everywhere. What's up, hackers? It's Gully Box, and today we are ringing in the holidays with these three awesome DIY ornaments. Yes, you can hang them, you can give them as gifts, you can wear them as dangly earrings. The options are endless. It's time to hack your world. And for our first hack, we have DIY unicorn ornaments. Yes, they have a horn, they have ears, they have everything. Which one will look best on camera? The blue one. They have glitter in them. She's so cute, I'm gonna name her Cindy. And I made all different types of colors. We made some gold, because gold -y. Purple, because purple. Yay! Turquoise, oh, there's Hulk glue attached to it. Oh, I have my little tree. Patrick, we're gonna separate his little arms real quick. Are they arms? No, they're branches. He's a person, so. But we're gonna take Cindy, and we're gonna put her on the tree. There we go. Yeah, we're hacking it. Yeah, we're making it work. That's like the saying of the channel. We'll make it work. <laughs> For these unicorn ornaments, you'll need a clear ball ornament, glitter, floor cleaner, craft clay, sticker jewels, stiff felt, a small funnel, and string. First, remove the caps of the ornaments and add floor cleaner. Add glitter inside and swirl around until it sticks. Using the clay, make the horn and attach it. Now finish the face with a marker, felt, and jewels. Add string! Now hang up your unicorn mints. The best part, there's loose glitter. So you can shake it. It's just, it's a good fun. Most ornaments are made of glass, but I'm clumsy, so this is plastic, so no breakage here. Especially because it's a small tree, if it like falls off, we're good. Okay, you know how glass is made? It's literally made out of sand, molten sand, basically. It's like melted down and shaped, and like they blow into this, and I don't know how they get the perfect shape every time, but like, that's their problem. You know how I know that? <laughs> I play uh, Minecraft. You know, in like your little box, you have to like get the sand from like the desert and then you have to get the water and then you have to like heat it up in the furnace. Moving on. And for our second hack, we have Block Twist. It's been there the whole time. They're little tea light snowmen. Yes! Look at that little face. There's more. We have top hats. You thought it was done, you thought wrong. Yes, we have options because not everyone's like a top hat person, not everyone's like an earmuff person. So, you know, we have some options. Let's go put them on the tree. When I was younger, I used to fight with my brothers about who can put like the topper on the tree because tall roof, tall tree, I was like two inches tall. I would have to like stand on a ladder and stuff. My grandmother gave me this like beautiful snowman glass ornament and I was like so excited. So I put it on the tree and I put it on one of like the really like limp arms and I like put it on and just and then I just sit down. <laughs> you can watch. You get like demoted to like DJ instead of like tree decorator. For this DIY, you're gonna need tea lights, thin red ribbon, red glitter ribbon, red pipe cleaners, red pom poms, and black felt. If your LED light is white, then just use an orange marker to make his carrot noise. So with a Sharpie, add your mouth and eyes of the snowmen. Dress up the snowmen with ribbon, pom poms, felt, and pipe cleaners. Now, turn on your snowmen. Oh, look how cute they look on the tree. They're friends with the unicorns. 
We love that. Guys, comment down below what your like wildest decorating story of the tree was. If you're as clumsy as me, you know what I mean? I just wanna feel less bad about myself. <laughs> Even if it's like not that crazy, just like comment down below like a fun Christmas story. Because I love reading your comments, seriously. I read every single one. Like you think I don't read all of them, I read all of them. And for our third hack, last but not least, we have crayon ornaments. They're little crayons, you melt them in this gl Is this glass? Glass. I did the like original Christmas colors of the green and red, but they kind of turned brown. I like the winter wonderland, hence my theme. Definitely goes better with the tree. Yeah, uh, it's super cute. I almost had like a heart attack there. Okay, it's just gonna lay on the floor. She's lazy. We need a topper. What can we use as a topper? Oh my gosh. That won't stick, but just like, I'm gonna do some CGI, ready? Boom, it's lighting up, wow, it's a full tree. Look at that. <laughs> when you're like on a budget. <laughs> For this DIY, you'll need clear ball ornaments, crayons, a grater, funnel, hair dryer, wax paper, and gloves. Grate paperless crayons and funnel into the top of the ornament. Now, wearing gloves, start to heat the outside with the hair dryer and melt the crayons. So satisfying. That's some melted goodness. <gasps> They're heart balloons. Oh my gosh, this is for my Valentine's Day episode. They're little, they're little hearts. And my tree is complete. Thumbnail. I'm so sad this episode's over. This was such a fun one. That is it for my holiday DIY ornaments episode. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, make sure to leave a like down below and subscribe for more DIYs every Friday and we're building robots on Saturday. Comment down below what your favorite was. I think my favorite was definitely the little unicorn ornaments. I think they just look so good. And the weekly goalie squad shout out goes to Sunnyside Up. She is so sweet. Like, you guys just make me so happy. It's just extra love and joy. Also, if you guys make any of these ornaments, no matter what, if you have a little Patrick, tag my Instagram. Make sure to like follow me on Instagram. I post very frequently there. There's a lot of giveaways. Goalie Blocks and Patrick. Signing off! <laughs> hey, Goalie Squad. We're doing giveaways all month long. We just gave away an iPhone XS, but we're not done gifting. Watch tomorrow's robot battle to see what we're giving away next. Oh, and hit that subscribe and notification bell so you're the first one to know.